What's up guys, Zach and JR here, and today we are super excited to introduce the new youth bow from Hoyt, the Cobalt. Stay tuned. All right, guys, welcome back. Like we said, we're super excited about this bow. Um, this is brand new from Hoyt. This is the new uh, Cobalt. Um, I've got JR here. We're actually gonna go over the specs of this bow um, and just kind of talk about it. So JR, what are we looking at? What do we got? Yeah, so this is, um, as, as we've already said, the Hoyt Cobalt. It's a brand new youth bow. They haven't done one since, since about 2018, if I remember right from the, it was the Clash. The Clash, yeah. So this is sitting at a 29 and a quarter inch um, Axle to axle, it's a six and a seven inch brace height. Uh, the overall weight of the bow is in around 2.8 pounds, that's dry, so there's no, no accessories in it, anything on the bow for that. Uh, it's very adjustable to go from a seven pounds all the way up to 45 pounds, and the draw length is adjustable from 18 inches to 28 inches. So this bow is perfect for any kid getting into archery. I mean, 2.8 pounds, yeah. this thing weighs nothing. Yeah. So super manageable, even for some of the littler guys. Yeah. And then with the ability for that draw weight and that draw length, it's gonna. This is gonna give the the kid. They don't gotta buy a new bow every year. Right. It's gonna grow with them. Yeah. Yeah. I'd say you you should be able to grow to, to, into this bow until you're probably about 14, give or take. I mean, it depends on how big you. Yeah. Are. It depends on the kid. You know, average. But I would say about 14 years old before they really need to look at getting a, a better bow, a full size adult yeah. size bow. Yeah. Agreed. Um, this thing, and you know, one of the things looking at this bow, this bow is sharp. Yep. I mean, especially for a, a youth bow, we see a lot of the youth bows come through and they're, you know, they are what they are, they're yep. youth bows. Yep. But this thing is, it, it looks like a Hoyt yep. high-end bow. Yeah, exactly. So we're sitting on, on Hoyt Tech Riser, which is awesome. It's been used for 20 plus years. It's a great, great riser. They always last forever. Hoyts are basically indestructible. So I'd be curious to see how well that can last. Um, one thing I did notice just by looking at it is if you want to upgrade this, you can easily upgrade any option on here. It does come with the standard four arrow fuse quiver, which we got right here. Um, we also have the uh, fuse three pin sight for the, the profile sight. Uh, it does come with the basic whisker biscuit, but if you want to add anything on there, like uh, let's say the fuse um, or the, the Hoyt super light quiver, you actually have the mount right here, built right oh, in that. Right in the frame. But right in that riser. The riser so that's, a, that's a cool little feature that they put on there for this. And we're talking about, so this thing has the tech riser. So one of the cool things about the, the tech riser is actually perform, improves the performance of the bow, right. right? And especially with new archers, new archers really have a tendency to torque the bow mm -hmm. a lot, um, just you know getting into it. And one of the things with a torque riser is it actually increases the stiffness and the rigidity of the bow. So that helps reduce the bow torque, which is gonna right. make the, the, the young, the youth archer a little bit more proficient whenever they're behind the bow and actually right. shooting it. Yeah. yeah. So this thing, um, like we said, I mean, any kid looking at getting into to archery, this is a, a perfect perfect fit. I mean, it goes all the way down to seven pounds. Yeah, absolutely. And then grows with him all the way up to 45 pounds. Even, you know, this could even potentially be a fit for some young adults who are, you know, a little bit on the smaller side. I mean, it maxes out at 28 inches, okay. um, which is close to my draw length, mm -hmm. uh, and, and 45 pounds. So it's a good overall uh, well-built bow. Yeah. I mean, it's sharp looking yeah, too. I'm right? excited for it. I mean. One of my first impressions of it is it's like, it looks like an R7. When I saw it, I, I even pulled my R7 up to it and it looked very similar to it. It does, it looks yeah. sharp, man. It's like a yeah. little mini one. Yeah. yeah, super cool looking. The colors are phenomenal too. Yeah. Um, um, what, what colors is this thing coming in this so, year? So we got the wilderness green right here. We're gonna have, there's gonna be a blackout option. 
uh, buckskin, which is that tan color, yep. and then there's also a camel color too. So, yeah. so we will have all of them available. Yeah. We're carrying them um, in the ready to shoot package. So like JR said, that's coming with your, your fuse um, profile three pin sight. Um, it's coming with your what, your four arrow, fuse the Maxis four arrow quiver, and then a whisker biscuit. So right out of the gate, the only thing you need with this bow, after you purchase the bow, is a set of arrows on release yeah. and you're ready to shoot this thing. Yeah. So great gift. Perfect for any young archer coming up. Um, we have them plenty in stock, but they're yeah. slowly starting to trickle in now. Um, unfortunately, you can't buy them on the website, right. but you can come in the shop. We'll have them in stock, ready to set up for you. Yeah. Um, but if you're interested in them, check them out. We've got them online at the website, extremeoutfitters.com. Um, so you'll have all the specs there, being able to go over it and get an idea and see if it's you know the, the perfect fit for your kid. Yeah. So. You know, make sure you like and subscribe, follow along for us. We'll be dropping more videos as we get, you know, into the, the season. We're almost there right now. Okay. Um, so make sure you're following along. Check out our social media platforms as well. Uh, we'll be doing more giveaways. We just did an awesome giveaway. Yep. Uh, we gave a bino harness from Mr. Ranch away. Uh, we got a lot more stuff lined up. So make sure you're following all our social channels as well. So see you next time.